It's time to give him my own. My all is I am no clue. I just know that's what I say every time I boot the game. Meaning I must. Anyway, we back. Honey, I can probably put in the fridge. I have more materials I can't really do anything with at the moment. I can sell the fish. Why don't we help Daria with them? Good morning. I saw you're psychic. There you are. I've been waiting. You really ought to give the whole listening to others thing a try sometime. Never mind that for now, psychic. I don't recall becoming your psychic either. Never mind that for now, psychic. My shelf broke. So, what? You want me to fix it? What? Heaven, though, that's the job of the artist, me. The job of the psychic, you, is to bring the materials. So give me iron and lumber, one of each. No. Okay. I definitely don't have that one. Or leave it there. Well, I can give you this since I don't really want this in my inventory. Yes! Best throw. Oh, yeah, yeah. The lumber I need, and I just need the iron. Here's the iron. Which we have. Where'd it go? Pimpo. Very nicely done. Now I can fix my shelf. Here's a reward. Oh, wow, you handled that with flying code. I knew I chose you as my cyclic cake for a reason. Um, like I said before, I never actually agreed to that. Yeah, yes, I know. It's intimidating being a psychic to an artist of my caliber. But there's no reason to be shy. Hold your head up with pride. For you have the respect of the one and only Daria. Anyway, I'll leave you when I need you again. See you. You're welcome. Oh no, oh, material needed. Well, good morning. Uh -huh. Sunshine, the fishes are happy. Here because of my quest? Yep. So I just need to find some materials for you. Bring me a squid. Um, something wrong? It's supposed to be for bat. Uh huh. Okay then. Counting on you. Thanks for fun. Thanks for fun. You're welcome. Oh, unfortunately, I had a bit of bad news to share. What happened? Now I saw what I posted on the message board. When I told her I wanted to add Squiddy to the water, she said it would stain everyone's skin. <laughs> I mean, she's not wrong. So I decided to give up on the idea for now. I'll have to take the Squid to snack out later. Alright, you like eating Squid, don't you? See, it's all because of the story I heard called the Squid and Tuna. This tuna was just swimming along, carefree as could be. And then this giant squid comes out of nowhere and gobbles the poor thing up. That's why squids are evil. They'll eat them all for what they have done. Oh, uh, good luck with that. Do my quest for vengeance with the one you brought me. Here's <laughs> a little something as thing. Yup, it's raining. Just like in real life. Because in real life, it is raining where I am. Hello, it's a rainy day. Perfume. Uh, the Ismail really Magic Pile. We have those. The Ake Arken. I'm really good. The Defluffing Festival is coming up. I like my best magic seeds. Grow the water spring plant that lets you fill your water pot. Banana magic. Grows a banana sheet plant that makes foes slips. Makes foes slip. Jack magic seed. Grows a pumpkin shaped plant that'll help you. I technically could buy this. But also, what's the banana one gonna do? I kinda want this for funny. For the funny. Do you like the arcane art? You, have, you smell nice. I wish I could have you a bio so I could bring you out any time on Pregnant Pick Me Up. Yeah, don't do that. What Scary. Good morning. Good morning. Oh my, is that perfume? I had quite the collection myself back in my younger days. The Beef Bluffing Festival, is it? What shall I do? I don't think I wanted to read that when I, and then I read it and I felt uncomfortable. Full health, full RP. Should I attempt the boss again? He got those I should ask you to help out. Let's do this. 
it'd be even worse if he dies immediately. I already saved. I'll at least get the full health though. Or most. Whatever I can. I don't want to waste the rice ball here. I think I have enough time. I might be able to beat it. Let's go. Oh yeah, I forgot to um do the whole. You know what? Why not? One at a time. He's dead. I know you're gonna attack. He's dead. I'm not gonna alarm you, but I'm doing unexpectedly well. Also, the fact that the rice balls heal a lot. Look at that, bam. God. Oh. Ooh. Also, I'm very luckily dodging way more than I usually do. That's so lucky, I thought I was cornered. Oh, I hit dodge, it didn't work. I did it. Oh my god, I did it. As long as the mega trailers start working. Oh, you have no idea. Oh, absolutely. Oh, that was. I managed to beat it. Like, ah, ah, ah. That fight all night. <laughs> well, I mean, it took all day. Are you okay? You weren't hurt, are you? I mean, were you? No, I'm fine. Really? Thank goodness you are all right. I'm sorry I worried you so much. So why did it suddenly attack us out of the blue like that? Hmm. hmm. Karuna, I think I know. Have you gone to collect the cactus flowers at all recently? Just thing you at. I just had Mel pick one for me actually. Why? That monster attacked us is partial to cactus flower? That's why. I suspect that must have been some connect there must have been some connection to why I went to Zerk. Then it was an ancient bone I thought it's kind of died out a long time ago. I think there were sur still survivors and we sniffed one out. I've let something truly regrettable transpire today. I'm sorry for the trouble I caused you too, Mel. No, it's fine. Oh, and please don't forget to bring the text to me later. I appreciate it. I will. Let's do this. Here you go. There, that is both of them. Thank you very much for your help. It was nothing. And please let me apologize for dragging you into that commotion earlier. That's okay. It's not like you planned for it and I died m many times. Here, take this and to my gratitude. Thank you. Thanks. Oh, before I forget, hmm? There's an unusual spot at the back of the settlement. It wasn't all that strange for a long time, but soon after you visited us, a strange ore man is there. No one knows why it's there or how it got there or why. No one can touch it either. Uncanny, wouldn't you say? An orb, huh? Do you mind if I go and look at it? On the slant. I'll make sure the gate is open for you and investigate your leisure. Thanks. Alright, see Zed. I need to quickly go grab this so I can finally get my my storage upgrade. There it is. I think there was another orb here. Runa said that the orb appeared shortly be before I came to the cell. I wonder. Hurry up. I need my storage. I'm saying the darkness. Thanks for all you do, Mel. It can't be easy being the town guard. Don't mention it. All in a day's work to keep everyone safe. No, you have to help. There's no one else we can turn to. You're sure I'm on it. Ooh, we knew we could count on you. You did a great job. We can all live here in ease knowing we have such an amazing keeper of the feast. You bet, but the town is my duty and I'm glad to do it. Hmm. Now I remember my real name. 
Ismail, of course. I was never wrong about my name. I thought it was just some name I came up with on the spot. I think it was actually my real one. Wild. <laughs> Look what in the town guard. I have a vague feeling that I was protecting someone. The town, the residence? Exactly which town guard was I even in? Does that matter? I don't know. No good, I can't remember anything else. Should look for the next orb. That one might bring back some more memories. Oh, well, come over here a second. Oh, I'm not in my weird... What's up? I had a bunch of lunches made for up for my customers, but I went a little overboard and ended up making too many. I'm not going to waste food, so I figured I'd give you a give away the extras. Are you interested? Well, really? I don't mind. I mean, you don't mind? Not at all. You'd be doing me a favor. Swing by my place for it later, okay? Don't spoil your appetite. Good thing. Great. See you later. Well, it's kind of late. <laughs> Time to take a nice nap. After all, it is 9 p.m. Me, 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 me. Cabbage. Alright. Technically, I should be cleaning up the farm. Look how messy it is. Messy, messy. Should be embarrassed living in this filth. I don't know why I went Gorn Ramsey there for a second. <laughs> kind of weird. Kind of wild. I'm sure it's boring. I'm sure nobody enjoys watching me throw grass. Oh, I gotta go grab lunch. Let me tell them my outfit. Oh, yeah. You know what? Fine. Let's, let's uh, see if we have material. Hurry. Please. Please. Hurry. Hurry. I, I need... I need my upgrade, please. No! <laughs> Honestly. It's because of the festival, actually. That makes a lot more sense. This house, indeed. Really? What do you think? It's not bad. Is it not to your liking? I'm thinking of adding a box fear trim here as an accent. I really can do it. Oh, that could work. Right and perhaps here and here. Hello, I was... Excuse me. I was called... Uh, oh, Mela, what are you doing here? I asked him to come. Mela, I asked him... I have some materials I'd like you to fetch. If you would mind, then you'd be so kind. Sure thing, what do you need? Lumber. Three pieces. Alright. Let me see you. You can also see Mary and pick up some ore. Oh, odd ore. Oh, there's a teleporter in my thing now. Oh, I'm gonna guess that's to teleport me to the... To the... Um... To them. Uh... Mary, odd ore. Morning. Morning. What's wrong? Are you sick? I'm fine. I asked me to pick up something for her. Gotcha. So you want a potion or a shot? And don't tell. Oh, don't tell me. I know you're here for a shot. No, no, and no. How about uh something? I'm not sick. Jeez. Someone asked me to pick up some on ore for you. Aw, um, what? You're not? Why didn't you say so? Got my hopes up for nothing. I did say so repeatedly. On ore. Hmm. Got that here. What are you for? It? No idea. She asked me for lumber as well. I'm about closing here. I think you meant. Uh, that. Uh, interesting. You know about it? That I do. Exactly with a synthetic replica of animal fur. I think I read somewhere that there's a technique for extracting fibers from lumber to make the fur. But I speak the lumber then. So I doubt you can find the equipment for that prop. It's that far in the countryside. Maybe that's why she's asking for the ore? Maybe. Anyway, if I'm country. If anything happens, come shoot to me, okay? I'll keep my sermon sharp and point Gabby. Believe me, I'll keep my fingers crossed. Thank you. Thank you. All I need is the three lumber. Here you go. Thank you. Excellent. There's all the material I require. Thank you. No problem. I hope the outfit turns out well. It ought to. All I have to do is cut these into appropriately sized chunks, sew them on here and there, and voila. It'll be complete. Huh? Huh? What's up? What's wrong? Nothing. Just, uh, you're really going to use that stuff pretty much as is. Of course, it's important to me that I showcase the natural beauty of my material. Why didn't you say you want a uh, fox fur? Uh, I thought you were going to use it in place of, you know, real fur. Why ever would I do that? If I wanted to use fur, I would ask you to bring me some. Oh, that'll teach me to mix up. Anyway, thank you very much for your assistance today. Your head doesn't work, does it? This isn't much, but I think it doesn't work. 10,000? Sure. Well, hold on. This isn't much of a reward. It's 10,000. Oh, it's you, Mom. is saying to come to the shop if you ever need furniture. Furniture? Yes! 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 There he is. Good morning. Not participate. Yeah. You're registered. I guess I am using a hammer. Oh, no. I can use other points. I think the point... You're gonna get... Pass. 
perfect. So I think you're... This is... Yeah, I think I should use the duels. No, no, I'm the timer. I'm watching it and I'm a little scared. Okay. Well, thankfully, he's stuck. Yes. Wait, hold on. I got him stuck. Oh my god, I got him stuck. Built to end. Winner is. Hey, we're going to 6,108 points. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think we with 5,900. Wow, I actually was really close. If I wasn't running and trying to catch up, I would have been fine. Oh my goodness. I'm a little sad. Only a little bit. No, just kidding. I'm really sad. I was so close. Farming bread. So use the four. Oh, she is dead. But uh, are you good? Are you okay? Uh, why are you on the ground? Ow, oh, are you hurt? Are you? Obviously, I said, ow, dang it, what the heck was that? What happened? Long and long, I was saying, huge shout was like whoosh right in front of me, and then it was like roaring. I was like, god, and I fell right over it. We take a deep breath calm down. Let's try that again at about one quarter speed. Oh, yeah, right. And also, yeah, without the music. I can do what I have to take your time, I'm here. So I had lunch and I was gonna bring it to you, then this giant chest swooped in right into my face. Caught me off guard, I nearly jumped out. <laughs> I nearly jumped out of my skin, I ended up tripping over my feet. Then the shell pound snapping my the lunch and disappearing with a whoosh. Fun. <laughs> yeah, I figured I could sell lunch as a tourist, so I was experimenting with some stuff. Now I can ask your opinion on it. But then that shadow had to go and snatch it from me. I guess I... I'm glad it took the food and not me, but still. I put so much effort into making that salted char. You know how big the shot was? Not really. Oh, I've been so fast, I didn't get a good look, sorry. That's okay. That was more of a fright than I planned on. I admit, the whole thing has me concerned, but I'll look into your assailant. If you remember anything, let me know, okay? You got a thing. Wait, I remember! That was fast. The a big shadowy thing he flew off to Onward Valley. I overhear some customers of mine talking about how they've been hearing weird howling around the area. I remember being concerned because that area is tourist hot, tourist hot spot. That sounds like something is up in Onward Valley. It is an odd place. You're the best. Be careful. Appreciate it. Uh, I'm using their clothes because it's holiday. Fine. Open trials. That's been there for a while. Why don't we go check that Good out? Good morning. Good morning, guys. You really need to have a festival where you collect iron ore so woolly fur balls. I'd be all over that. Logically speaking, I can't say I ever see that happening, but uh, you can hang on to that dream guy here. Good oh. morning. What brings you in? Uh, I'm here to see your granddaughter, I guess. No, I was waiting for you. Today, I want you to bring me some tests of uh patience. See them here to the apothecary if you would. You're gonna you're gonna be more careful with your word choice of words. A new potion ought to be effective against all known cold symptoms, eye strains to shoulders or back, and pretty much everything else you can imagine. Accordingly, just about anyone will do for a sub patient. For this particular round of experiments, their individual symptoms are irrelevant. Frankly, symptoms aren't even required. Pointless to test medicine on people who are perfectly healthy. There wouldn't be any resort to result or record. Start getting everything together but for their arrival. Bring me whoever you can as soon as possible. I never agree to. Off you go then. Hey, you wanna be? You wanna? Very good news. I heard. Oh, that she has a strict rule of mine that she can only make my, uh, my supervision. <laughs> really, that's a relief. I'm feeling a lot better about this now. But should no one will die over at any rate. I take that. Back. Looks like you got a hard tune, huh? though. What do you mean? Mary's dragged you into experiments, hasn't she? I've been there, trust me. Like, whenever I so much as catch a cold, she'll try to she'll make... She's making me try her potions. Like, this one time, I had a cough. 
he jammed me with that big syringe of hers. But it just made me shiver big time until I began laughing my head off nonstop. And then, okay, okay, I get it. I am so gonna die. Hey, guy. But the number that asked me is there, they were willing to be a volunteer patient for her. That right, to be honest, I'm feeling a little under the weather. I was thinking of hitting the apothecary this weekend. But really then, I'll hear up over the weekend. Definitely not today. Too much going on. Hello. Hello. Look, tell me, is something the matter? Yeah, maybe you asked me to find patient this for new medicine, but I'm not having a lot of luck. My, how unfortunate. I'm sure you yes. could. You need something else? <laughs> no, I'm good. You scared Hello. Hello. Hello, Mel. Hello. What can I do for you? Well, Mary asked me. Marion's asked me to bring her some oh, patient dear. Oh, do I look unwell to you? No, that's not really what I. I'm fairly healthy, thank you. Uh, yes, yes, I'm sure you are. Okay. Hello. What do you want? What do you think of the clam, Monica? Do you like it? I hate it. <laughs> I could have seen that one coming. Wait, I just realized it right here. Who knows for better weather? Hello. Why the gloomy cloud, brother? Something eating at you? I guess you could say that. See, hold your horse. I know exactly what's pulling you out. It's about Carmen, is it right? She's the prettiest girl in the whole town. No, the whole world. I know exactly what you're feeling right now. Trust me. Uh, no, actually, but I'm not with them anyway. I haven't tried anything funny with her. Nobody. No matter who they might be, catch my drift. What's up? Hey, Carmen, you wouldn't happen to be feeling unwell at all, are you? Unwell? Not that I'm aware of, no. My health is one of my few redeeming qualities, you know. <laughs> uh, uh, you said this point one. Uh, hey, this isn't working. It's about time. I mean, I can't give it to anyone. Oh, now you're here. That will suffice. Here's my latest greatest potion. Go on, down it all in one mighty gold. I'm not sick. Because when did that matter? When the potion. It matters a lot, but you're so stubborn. You leave me no little choice then. Huh? You assistant with your own administration. I'll just have to give it to you directly as an injection. You're not seriously gonna force me to buckle up and hold on tight. This is the only thing for a moment. I'm dead. That doesn't seem right. Where am I? Oh, you're awake, lad. That's right, I must have passed out when Mary gave me the shot. I already cured the lingering effects. You ought to be able to get up soon. Thanks, I owe you. Hello, you're awake? Yes, I'm dead. Marin, you are to be quiet around patients. Uh, <laughs> sorry. No, I'm sorry. Huh? I tend to get a crippling case of tunnel vision whenever a grand DA expires, BC. As long as you denies that what you did is wrong, it's all water under the bridge. Oh, thanks. I'll do better, I promise. And I'll be sure to include far more point healing magic in the next one. Uh-huh. Well, I almost forgot here. An apology and a thank you. I hope you find it useful. <laughs> I'll never be able to grab this. I got it. I think I got sick. <laughs> she gave me sandals. I don't think I have anything else to do. And it doesn't matter because I have to save... Oh, you know what? Since I have more money, I could definitely... Uh, I can't buy anything today as I just thought of about it a little bit harder that if one store is closed, they're all closed on holiday. Oh my god! Wow! What if for that quest you only had to ask one person and we went around asking multiple people? Why did I turn to do that? I'm really, really smart today. It's also funny that I was like, oh yeah, I can use a hope for this. I didn't know. And now I'm only using the hope for it. I can just clear it all off later. Plus, um, it's, it's pretty far in the time. And it's thundering, don't want to lose the recording, so next time. See you later, goodbye!